So, hi guys, Craig Hansen here, and thanks for tuning in, thanks for watching the video. We're going to have a look at, yeah, some model positions and model swings, um, plane, a few numbers and a few angles. So, yeah, the idea of swinging a club in perfect balance, um, why do we do it? You know, why, do we, why do we try and get a golf club perfectly on plane? What's the idea behind it? When many people say it doesn't sort of matter how you swing the club back. Well, to swing the club back in perfect plane or, or ideal positions, you're essentially keeping your body also in perfect balance. So you're controlling not only your body's balance, but the sweet spot of the golf club. So the, obviously your arms have weight and the club has weight. And if you swing them back in off plane, or off balance, your body will tend to go with it. Now, we know that many champions do this. And you could probably look at a champion like a, like a cat. Right? You pick a cat up and you twist it around and throw it in the air and it's probably going to land on its feet. And you look at a club golfer and a club golfer, probably a little bit like a dog. You turn it upside down and you drop it, it's going to land on its head. So a lot of the people need to sort of swing back and move the club in a efficient way. Now we can look at numbers, degrees and angles and think that they're complicated or mechanical but you can be technical without being mechanical. Now obviously impact is the key. I've always had to laugh when people say it's only about impact because it's a long way to get to impact um, from the start position and we can get ourselves way out of impact before that, and most people don't have a correct impact position anyway. So knowing exactly what impact is, um, understanding your, your own individual patterns in a swing. But it is interesting in the idea, because I think a lot of people have been trying to do it for many years now, is to try and swing it like a, a model golfer. And is it possible and does it help? Well, yeah, it does. You know, if you swing it really good and your impact's really good, and your sequence is really good, you'll hit the ball really good. Yeah. So here's one of my guys I'm teaching. You know, now these days with mobile phones, like this is an iPhone 6, like you don't need cameras anymore. I mean, check out the clarity of the shaft, the face, and the swing. So this is Dodge Kemmer, who, you know, me and Dodge have been doing a lot of work. Now Dodge was injured last year, and it's just won the first stage of the qualifying school in Europe uh, with minus 16, one by four shots. He played well in Russia in a European tour event just recently. And, you know, he hasn't perhaps been putting as well as he would like, but looking at plane and the economy of motion and, and seeing someone, you know, really hit a lot of greens in regulation, beautiful iron shots and hit one ball after another, it's, it's very, very interesting looking at changes to plane, balance, and sequence. And biodynamics, well, that's perfectly on plane, the face is perfect. I've been involved in biomechanics a lot this year and working with some of the, the best in the world and, and the things that you understand about a person's individual uh, individual swing or pattern is that you know, they're all different, but if you can take a piece at a time and work on it patiently, you can fix it. And you can create some amazing position. And it is now these days possible to work online. I mean, you can, you've got email, you've got Skype, you've got phones like this. And you're coming in to impact. You've got thousands and thousands of examples of golfers and model golfers in slow motion. Yeah, I've been now working with so many people from all over the world online so if you it's definitely possible to do you can have some fantastic results now check out the website craighansongolf.com you can see how to set your phones up and uh, you can send us something through and we can get you going and get you on the right track and and turn your golf around and uh, you know there's definitely a swing that you can get that makes it hard physically to hit it offline and there's definitely swings out there that make it difficult to actually physically hit the ball straight. So look at your technique and get the correct information, check out the website and uh, 
and be happy to get you going. So.